Hey, man. It's the ISO God Sensei, the greatest 2K in existence. Now, look, in this video, we're going to be going over a 2K insight, breaking down some new gameplay features in a future My Player Builder NBA 2K25, okay? There are some actual leaks in the video. Leak, 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 leak. Saying slashing is going to be something that we've never experienced in no 2K. The logic is going to be fixed and that they're buffing defense again. Let me know how y'all feel about that. And they talking about the builder, all this free template again. I, I just, I just don't understand and much more. But before we get into any of that, y'all make sure y'all subscribe. If y'all are new, man, help me hit 296 K point three. We are 90 subscribers away. We covering all the 2k 25 news, best jump shots, best builds, best dribble moves. So you ain't got to waste your money when the game come out, man, or your time. You want to stay tuned. The cost of making builds. I decided to come up with template builds. That were bro what what is demi talking about guys why is he bringing up temp why would 2k go to free to play why would 2k go to free to play and free builds that are 99 overall what is he talking about is he is he just trying to get the idea in the community's head to accept template builds and to not look at them as my team cards that, i mean that that's what it looked like to me because if people look at them as my team cards and they'll be completely against template build feel me because you already know how my team getting done back so i mean I think, I think Demi really trying to implant some stuff, man. Free to play that you can just make, um, not make, I'm sorry, you can just take a build from each position that you would like, take it into the park, and then animations can be adjusted accordingly because obviously if one animation is too overpowered, it can be fixed, right? And then- They could do that now. Of course, the big thing is, is that the issue that a lot of people have is they want to have a superstar build that can do everything. <clears throat> My response is no problem, okay. Get the template build, work it, work hard on that build, grind it out. And then of course, something as like a legend or whatever like that will allow you to be a true for once in the, for the first time ever in 2K history, you can have like a real legit Steph Curry, Michael Jordan, Kobe Bryant, LeBron James. So I guess Demi got a uh, build return, man. They're gonna start us out at 99 overall. Think, think, think about that, man. They gonna start us off at 99 overall. And then I guess like your legend grind just increases your player crazy. I don't know, man. I, I don't, I don't like it, bro. It's just, it's not true, bro. It's just not going to happen. There's just no way. I think he's really just trying to plant the seeds of template builds so then they can, my team, the my career mode, bro. Will Chamberlain, Shaquille O'Neal, you could do that, right? I think that that would be something that would be really good and refreshing for the game, okay? So I have mentioned these no, all the time. Now, it's of course, already in these my are very team. ambitious ideas. That does not mean that it's going to happen, but I do not think a lot of people are going to disagree with the fact of that it has been getting ridiculous, the cost of just playing this game, uh -huh. and there is ways for 2K to monetize this game without having to put How? us in position to where we have to pay so much money on bills and then all of a sudden we find out halfway through the only way for them to monetize another way is to spam skins and mascots i don't think 2k would do that pretty lazy company so this whole free to play no template builds is i don't understand i don't even understand why he's uh, like talking about this and he doing this he's saying in like hella videos like i'm confused bro you know the second week of the game release that our build is no longer viable we got to make another build we got to spend all this money now the way 2k can make their money i did talk about how we can still do free to play template builds where you know you can get on the game and play for free and then where can 2k monetize that i did do a video on that i probably dropped that at the end but i'm not i don't want to get too long-winded in that aspect i just want to kind of refresh anybody that has not been no, watching you didn't. my videos of what direction i've been trying to go because i am getting to the point to where it's like yo something really has to change when it comes to the monetization of uh, yeah. 2k and how they go about it and i think the big thing is just allowing builds to be free with templates that can potentially be grinded out to you know a true superstar um build at the end okay but anyway we're here for slashing and i wanted to talk about this because what is he talking about bro what video did two did he say they could monetize of like 2k being like do y'all do y'all remember only way that i could think of is how i said it you know they would be dropping template builds like my team cards and spamming skins i know like how every season every week they drop different template builds and people buy them and stuff like that that's the only way i could see them giving people builds that are already like usable and stuff like that that's the only way like 2k is way too greedy Bro. That's the only way. I want to say first and foremost, I do feel like the addition of the dunk meter has been really, really good. Okay, the idea of it has been good. I feel like standing dunks are way are, are more effective and have Broken. more thick uh, results than driving dunks. Okay. Um, what what is Demi talk? Standing dunks are. Bro, standing dunks, they are more broken than driving dunks, bro. All you got to do is do the triple threat standing dunk. 
all you have to do, bro, I can do it on my 6'8". I don't even have to cheese like how they be doing in the program or the stage. All you have to do is know how to get position. You can literally just run in the paint and just get a little position. Go up with your standing dunk meter. And that, that's pretty broken, bro. I could drop like 40. I could literally drop 40 with my 6'8", my 92 standing dunk. In random rec, I'd, be, I'd just be like, hey, like, you know, like, you know, if, if they if they listen a little bit, I could literally drop like 40, like crazy. I just run in the paint. I could just wait, stand and dunk. It's broken. I don't I don't think it's realistic. It's really an arcade feature. And so is the drive and dunk meter. That hoe is broken and there's no logic to it. It's, it's cool. Like having an instant, you know, dunk button so you don't get them layups. You no, know, it's cool. It's fun somewhat, but that hoe is broken. All you gotta do is get by your man, do one move, go straight into your dunk meter. That's broken. And then when people don't got no D, you don't get no meter. You know, so I don't, I don't really know how to, they gotta figure out a better way to balance it because them hoes is broken. Maybe not. You playing straight NPCs because I don't ever see people in random rec really doing it they don't even know how they don't know anything they don't ever do the standing dunk meter they don't be doing the driving dunk meter you could tell by how then they not dunking on people you know that's why trying to cater to the negative one percent casuals thoughts is bro they don't even know how to do these things you feel me they don't even understand the game bro um standing dunks so in my opinion were really really strong this year i don't think anybody can disagree with that i mean yep. you're probably better off having a, a higher standing dunk than driving dunk and um i don't um, think that that's something that uh, should be for 25, right? Yeah. I think that at the end of the day, if any Leak, real Leak, hooper Leak. knows how the game is played, um, you're not really getting standing dunks like that in basketball because yeah. it's so difficult to get a standing dunk on a seven footer and that type of deal, unless you're a seven footer yourself. But in this game, you know, we had yeah. a lot of six seven, six six, um, running around, basically like your lockdowns or six seven lockdowns. Even that guards. Were, literally had like the 90 standing dunk going in the basket, just jamming, right? Like they were. I don't even know. Like, I can't even think of a small individual that has some dunking ability like that. Because even like, you know, Blake Griffin was six eight, six nine. But in my humble opinion, I think the standing meter dunks were really good. Um, but the driving dunks at issue. Now, I will say this, and this is where um, there is a little, you know, disagreement. So this idea that the dunk meter absolutely vanishes, even if you're on a six six pure slasher and you're going up against a five nine Spud Web and it disappears. I'm literally gonna tell you that I was told that that was on purpose because they wanted it to be mm. a skill gap and not be abused. And I said, I don't mm. think people are gonna receive that really well because you got sharpshooters that are still fading from half court hitting threes, you know? Think, 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 think about what he, what he just said, bro. So they knew about the problem, right? They knew if, I remember Badge Plug posted a tweet of Michael Jordan with like 99 dunk trying to go over Spud Webb and he couldn't get a meter. So they knew about that before they even dropped the game. <laughs> I don't think they understand coding, my boy. <laughs> I don't I don't think they understand coding, my boy. Cause I mean, God damn, bro. Like, why why would you ah, that just don't make sense to me? I mean, even even if even if someone don't have interior and stuff, they just it's tough. It's tough. Cause really, that that's crazy though that they released the game like that. They they need to uh, tear this game apart, bro. Cause that's horrible, man. It, it's still being cheesed either way, even with without it like that. I, I think uh maybe I don't know bro I don't know what the solution would be without it being like broken but like if someone don't have no type of interior D or whatever defensive badges you shouldn't have to get them at an angle to be able to yam on them you should be able to yam on them based off of ratings too you know what do y'all think there's a lot of um shooting that allows people to lean towards shooting and not slashing because shooting is so much easier on this game not just a sit a, st uh, a standstill shot we're talking about hop jumpers we're talking about fades <laughs> those type of shots are still really really easy to hit in this game yep. and for some reason slashers i put in a lot of you know money to get a 97 driving dunk to get precision dunker hall of fame they don't get rewarded by that because only time you really can get a dunk is if you have somebody on your hip to get the big meter. Where, whereas a standing dunk, yep. you can literally go into the basket, but if somebody jumps or about a position, the standing dunk meter is full green, you can get it. No one complains about the standing dunks because when we yeah, watch the game, we, we visually see what we're looking at, we get, we get the result that we expect. But when we're playing with our slasher driving to the basket and we see this little 6'3 guard in the paint and we try to do a pro stick dunk and the meter is literally small, then we have an issue with that because at the end of the day, you know, there's no way, shape or form, someone should have a 97 driving dunk and you go up against a small defender that doesn't even have any interior and your dunk meter, your green meter is non-existent. So yeah. that needs to be fixed like yesterday, okay? So to can they fix it? you should expect to have a massive difference when it comes oh. to your interior defense and getting dunks, lick, right? Lick, that lick, will lick, be the, lick, like, lick, if you look lick, at the lick, way lick. the game for each year to year, when there's massive issues the community have, expect that to be fixed. So expect if you- Hey bro, he leaking. Hey, he, how do y'all feel about that? They're gonna buff interior. We gonna see? 
I don't know, bro. I mean, but how are they going to do it? If they do it with like the physics and the logic, then like if they go at the angle of making it to where you can't do a hyperdrive move like the cross and uh oh damn if they do it like oh like no more john wall cross no more behind the back going vertical without no pauses so then it's harder to get the angle that would be corny that would just mess up the gameplay but uh because if they really do buff interior defense i think they capping though if they really do buff interior defense that means the layup cheese is getting nerfed. That means the floater cheese is getting nerfed. You know, but a lot of people was praising that with uh 24. So it's like, I think there should be defense in the game. I want defense in the game, my boy. No, that's me though. I think it's better for the game for casuals and skilled players. But if you have a high driving dunk and you're going up against a small defender or a defender that has very low interior defense. So if you make a seven foot center and you have no interior defense, expect to get dunked on, okay? Like expect to get dunked on and expect to get abused because you shouldn't make a center no interior defense, right? Or if you chose to make a, tier, a center no interior defense, then understand you should be getting dunked. Who's making a center with no interior defense? Who's doing that? So to me, that is going to be something that needs to be absolutely changed and will most likely almost 90, I'm 90% certain that, that will be changed oh. based upon the history leak, 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 of how leak, leak. 2K does from year to year <laughs> on making subtle changes. Some nation is looking like y'all getting nerfed, buddy. <laughs> Some nation is looking like y'all getting nerfed, buddy. For 25, it will be fixed. Now, expect with pro play also to have a huge input mm. when it comes to slashing as now, you know, I think ideally that slashing styles wow. will be implemented in the game to where you can be how would how would pro play affect slashing marketing gimmick marketing gimmick. be able to have your favorite dunkers vince carter michael jordan you know dominique Will so so all the animations we have now are fake all the animations we've had uh for all these years that been mo capped and stuff like that they're just fake and now all of a sudden with the camera they can scan and have a more realistic um animation i guess i, th I thought like you know physically having someone there could give you a more you know you know, scanning people, that just seemed like a, you know, that seemed like kind of an arcade feature. Against Blake Griffin, those unique type of like Euro steps, hop, um, bunny hops, and that type of deal to be implemented into a certain type of style. Like you had a running style, expect some type of slashing style. That's what I'm kind of oh, thinking. Slashing but style? at the end of the day, it's really, you know, hey, what 2K is going to do with it. But y'all let me know how y'all feeling. Pro play is not real. It is a gimmick. Were they William? I don't know, man. Most of the animations seem the same. I ain't going to hold you. It don't look game changing to me, my boy. I don't see it. So look, we got Ronnie Slander. Look, 1.6 million views. People, I really just hate everything about this guy. I hate the way he looks. He moves, he talks, acts, you name it. I hate it. A lot of people don't understand the Ronnie hate, but he's a liar. Okay, look, I'm going to show y'all a Ronnie compilation of Ronnie lying about insane things, bro. People are talking about lowering yeah, VC prices. Got Remember, guys, that like, gosh, I talked about this earlier. You can respec all your builds. So like, if you don't want to build 17... Do y'all know how crazy of a lie that is? Do y'all know how game changing that is? Imagine the 6-6 six, six you made this year. You wouldn't have to go make another 6-6 six, because six you could just respect the build. Like that means just redistribute the attributes that you earned and paid. You know how much money that would save you guys? Do you, do you guys know? And he was hyping this like he said it multiple times too, bro. I was heartbroken. I didn't believe it, but I was like, what? I'm like, there's no way. A lot of people don't know about this, man. In my players, you know that you can respect them. So that, that'll save you. People like jump to conclusions on what they saw in terms of the neighborhood in this trailer. Um, that's not the neighborhood, but you guys could think whatever you want. That, that's such an iconic thing to say, bro. Uh, I like that so many times. I believe you can respect as many times as you want. Look, think... look at what he's saying, bro. Guys, do y'all understand? He said you can respect as many times as you want. Isn't that false advertisement? Can't we like really like sue 2K? This is crudet. You cannot false promote like like on on Moses. You cannot false promote. That's crazy. I'm pretty sure people have gotten sued. Look, then then uh he got this tweet right here. You know, Just, you know. Hey man, y'all click this uh college football video on the screen. It is a funny moments and rage moments. It's hilarious. But hey, hey, here we go again. Yeah. Here, here we go again. People talking this for when this hit the fan. Everything I'm that made me. Now break it down. Yo, off the top of the dome, dome.